Welcome back to the Crooked Man. We might be finishing up scene two. Let's be on our way now. I think I know where I'm going. Of course, I say that and then completely blank out. Also, I might have been wrong about that one, uh, that one light board or whatever in the auditorium having something scrolled on it when I return there. Now, just to make sure that I know exactly where I'm going. Good. B is not over here. Wait. Alright, well, yeah, okay. Come over here anyway. So only a few keyholes be painted over. Yes, yeah, okay, there's nothing in the auditorium. Did I have to have a passcode to unlock it? I can't even remember now. It seems weird. This is the only place I haven't been. Yep, okay. Ooh. Uh Fuck. I've got a really bad feeling too. Ooh. Oh, the, tire, the thing is still going. Shit. Uh oh. Oh god. Ah, yep, that's right. Okay, there's nothing else in here. I should have checked what was in that other door, but I'm sure it was nothing. Wow. Oh, get on the other side, David. Some nifty music, gotta say. And part of D's sprite is poking out of the bed sheet. Alright, whatever. <laughs> it doesn't have to be perfect.
just sort of forgot about possibly life-threatening uh, information. <laughs> oh, am I going to have to make a decision to give him the, the page now or not? Okay, so it's not a choice. Oh, that doesn't sound like good. That's some more uh, music that I recognize. Uh, he's probably going to the third floor. Oh, maybe not. Oh, fuck. Oh, yeah, I keep forgetting. Ah, D. Where'd you go? Maybe the auditorium. The auditorium hasn't been used yet, so I'll cut off seeing that shit early. And the auditorium's nice and big. There we go. You could tell by the way that I couldn't move when I held up entering the room. His eyes are missing. His sprite wasn't like that the whole time, I'm pretty damn sure. Especially because mine isn't. So that's a whole, you know, like, glaring down Kubrick stare sort of deal. I should have saved before coming in. Um. Well, if I choose the wrong one, I can always do, but whatever. See, the problem now is that I want to give, like, I, I want to give, like, the, 
the morally best advice, which would be this, but is that the way the story should go? Because if I don't, I suspect that I'll get a bad end. That's right, the, the scene with the laptop. Kind of inferred that he failed, even though that kind of took a darker twist on it. Ah, oh, okay, that, yeah, okay. So it was more or less right. Alright. So I got that pipe. Mm -hmm. Uh, 
Did I do it the first time? Uh, 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 uh. Nope. I shouldn't have even tried. Ah! Oh, God. So, now I kind of have to wonder if it's possible to, after the monster reduces you to 20 HP, if it's possible to continue to finish the rest of the school without going to the infirmary to recover your health. Because then you're too slow to battle the monster. I'm sure. There's no, yeah, there's no way you're going to you're going to be able to run away from him in time. That would be a major setback. And if you're playing on one file, if that is possible, if you're playing on one file, excuse me, you play on one file, you don't use the other save files that are available to you, then you, you'd get fucked. Because you save just before the battle, you have no other save, you're too slow to battle him, you're dead. Unless the well, the energy drink recovers. No, the energy reco the energy drink recovers thirty. So maybe that's just a matter of hey, you have an extra hit or not. An extra, yeah, because you could take four hits there. Here, then you can only take three. Okay, so maybe the energy. Either way, your speed gets recovered. Well, then go, like, decapitate it or something. Oh, yeah. What was the hint that we got for next? Oh, okay, we didn't. Uh, that's what I was thinking. Like, I don't remember picking something up. Will we wind up back at the hotel, uh, at our apartment? Oh. If he doesn't, the monster's probably just going to kill him at home anyway, so. He got into this through no fault of his own. There we have it. I wonder what kind of com companion we'll have for scene three, and if that'll be the end of the game, or if we will have something just after scene three to close everything up. 
I would imagine we'd have to go back to the apartment at some point. But who knows? I didn't expect the game to be this long. But I knew... I, I figured once the prologue set in, uh, or the, the prologue title card came up, that it was going to be a pretty decent length. Especially after scene one being three videos long or so. And this one turned out to be about three videos. So it's pretty decent pacing. I wonder. But that's all for me. For now. And it's all for this part for now. Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. Next time, we'll take on scene three of The Crooked Man. Or at least we will begin it. I will see you next time. Take care, dear viewer. Thank <laughs> you.